Okay, and once your video finishes rendering, you'll see this little pop-up. It says Export Complete, and you can just simply close that. Then you want to go back over to your browser, to your Team Wukar site, and you'll notice that your keyword is still highlighted from before. And you'll want to click this Browse button and navigate to the path it's usually something like My Documents, Video Maker FX, Exported Videos. And you'll want to look for the file that matches your keyword phrase. So mine is Coupons, 1088 Howell Road. Um, if you can't easily find your video at the top, be sure to sort um, by clicking this Date Modified column twice and it'll sort with the newest stuff at the top. So I'm going to select my video and once it's in here I'm going to do a quick eyeball check to make sure that the name of my file matches my keyword phrase. Just do a quick little eyeball check here. Then I'm going to click Submit Video and when it uploads successfully Uh, we'll get a little green pop-up that says success. You have successfully posted a video to our system. Okay, so that video is done and then it presents you with a new keyword phrase. So I'm gonna stop this video and go through this process again. Actually I'll just keep going. I'll just stay here and keep going. So you have keyword phrase number two um, and actually, I'm sorry, I forgot to do something. Um, I still have my keyword phrase copied from last time. I meant to go into my notepad file and to paste that phrase in here because I want to keep up with um, the fact that I do 15 videos with this setting right here. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and um, just drop this into my notepad file and save that. Now I'm going to come and copy my second phrase. Go to Video Maker FX. I'm going to go through this pretty quickly now because this is going to be your process every time. You're going to click on slide one, text area three, paste in your keyword phrase, export project, edit the file name, backspace over kinetic customer, Paste in your file name and clean up the dot, change it to a dash, and start export. Now while this is rendering, at this point I can come to my notepad file and paste in my second keyword phrase. Um, actually, I should have returned. It should look like this. Okay. And we'll let this finish. And this template could be used for pretty much any customer keyword. Okay, export complete. I'm going to close, go back to Team Wukar, browse for my file. It should be at the top if I have things sorted properly. Pull that in and submit the video. Okay, so it uploaded successfully and it gave me a new keyword. So again, I copy the keyword, I go back to the video maker, click on slide one, text area three, paste in my keyword export project, change the name, paste in my keyword, change the dot in the website name to a dash, and export. 
go back to my notepad file, paste in my keyword phrase, save, wait for that to render. So as that renders, what I'm going to talk about now is how I use the same template with this person's name Jeff and the two testimonials with this name with these names and the music a better day I'm gonna do that for um, let me just type in the word video I'm gonna do that for 15 keyword phrases and you know as I populate my notepad file I group them by fives so they're easy to count once I get 15, then I'm going to copy this information up here and start a new section. And perhaps here I come in and I decide that instead of Jeff, I'm going to use um, the name Mike. And I'm going to do, um, I'm just going to make up these names as I go. Kelsey Swan. And actually that's a guy's name. Jim Kelly and Kelsey Swan. I'm just making up these names off the top of my head. And then I'm going to have to select the next song. So I'm going to show you that process in the next video. Let's go ahead and upload this one. So I'm going to close this. Browse for my file. Do a quick eyeball check that they're the same and submit the video. Okay, um, now I'm going to stop this video and come back on the next one and show you how to change your template for your next set of 15.